Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Big Jim with Big Jim Fishing. And have you ever reached into your rod locker when you have these type of rod socks and the hooks get all hung up in them because of the weave and then you fight and fight and try to get it out? There's been a lot of different rod socks that have come out and I have found the best ones and no, I am not sponsored by this company. I researched, I found them, and they are the best rod sock out there. And I'm gonna show them to you right after this. Yeah, guys, I'm just out here. It's a beautiful spring day, getting ready to go to Dale Hollow Lake. And, uh, you know, the last time I went up there for a tournament, I had these rod socks. And uh, they're the kind, you know, that have the plastic weave, you know, and it's got the elastic band. And some of them, you know, they're not long enough for like my big flipping stick or for my Carolina rig rod. And some of them, they're too, sh they're, uh, too long for my ultralight spinning rods. And I was just was frustrated. And, you know, <laughs> it happened to me in the tournament. Uh, my jerk bait come loose and I did not wrap it properly. And the hooks got hung up in, you know, the weave. And then I had a chatter bait that I had hooked over the reel and somehow the button got pushed in my rod storage compartment and the chatterbait got hung up in this and you almost have to cut it out. And I was just frustrated with it, man. I just really was. You know, some of them have tips on them. Some of them don't. The ones that are flat, that are just flat on the end, they're hard to store if you have a small boat because, you know, I have a 19 foot boat, so sometimes up towards the, the front where your rod tips go in, uh, it gets crowded up in there. And the ones that have the flat tip, you know, like this right here, they, they don't do very well. Well, I did some research and I have found the best rod socks. Evolve, yep. I ordered these, I paid full price. And if y'all noticed, you know, there's no paid promotion banner on this video because I'm just a consumer and I researched them, I bought them, they came in and they are the best. And I'm gonna tell you why they're the best. Uh, I wanna start that they're neoprene. And everybody that has seen videos know that, you know, if you get a hook in the neoprene, see, I got that hook in there and it just pops right out. That's, that's one thing that I love about them. But beyond neoprene, because there's a lot of neoprene companies, what made these Evolve stand out compared to the other ones are the following items. And this is what makes them the best on the market. Integrated into the tip, it's got sewn in a rubber point that is actually sewed into the neoprene. You can see I'm pushing on it. That's gonna protect your rod tip and that's gonna allow all the points to come together up inside your rod locker. That is one item that I absolutely love about them. The other item is right where the eyes go in, it's rubber. There's a, a rubber outside here, and it is sewn in as well. Let's see if I can get the, you can see the threading. It's sewn in as well. 
so it's not going to come off. I absolutely love that it has that, okay? Now, this is the model for the spinning rod. And here's the model for bait casters. And they have various lengths that you can order. You can see this is my big, long flipping stick here. And then I have a short spinning rod here. Now, do your measurements because I like the rod sock because of my rods where I hang my bait to be above that. And here's what's unique, and I, I know y'all are y'all see it right now. It comes with a tether where you can tether it to your reel that is adjustable. It has this adjustable tether right here. You can adjust how far that you want it, how tight, depending on the rod length. And I absolutely love these. I mean, it fits well on my cross B rods. Like, see, I got my chatterbait hooked on my rod up above the reel. And uh, by the way, this is a my new big gem rod. But uh, you know, it had there's a little space between that and the in the beginning of the rod sock. And then of course I have the adjustable tether wrapped around with the tension that I want. And you can see they all have pointed tips. And let me show you how easy they slide in. My big old rod here. Got my spinning rod. And what's neat is you can get them in different colors, guys. Y'all know I'm a fan of red and black, so I got the red thread on the black with the red logo. But uh, you can get them in different colors to match your boat, or if you want different colors for different action rods, and boom, there you go. Evolve rod sleeves. And uh, I'm gonna show the website right here. And you can see that you can get different sizes and they also have different colors and they're great. I love them. But yeah, I just wanted to share with you guys because sometimes I run across a product that isn't the cheapest, you know. Uh, I run a lot of DD26 stuff on my boat, and it's not the cheapest, but it's the best. And I want y'all to follow my channel because I only go over good stuff. I don't go over the cheapest stuff that won't last, stuff like that. You know, I never did a video on these rod socks because I hated them. Well, guess what? I don't have to have them anymore. They're gone. They're out of the boat. But yeah, follow this channel. When I do product reviews, it's over good stuff. Hit that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up. And ring that notification bell so that you'll get notified whenever I do a new video like these type of product videos. But hey, this is Big Jim with Big Jim Fishing. We really appreciate you guys that watch out there. And we will see you guys next time on a Big Jim Fishing video.